Welcome to Expert Tech. In this video we are going to learn how to enable Hyper-V in Windows 11. First, you need to check if hardware virtualization is enabled in BIOS. First step. Enable hardware virtualization in BIOS shut down your computer and then power on. Now, press the F10 key to enter the BIOS setup. In the BIOS setup, navigate to the Security tab at the top and then select System Security. Find the Visualization Technology (VTX) option and press the right arrow key to enable hardware visualization. Now the Virtualization Technology VTX is enabled, press F10 to save the changes. Under File, tab select Save Changes and Exit. Select Yes to confirm the changes. After saving the changes, exit the BIOS settings. Second step. How to turn on Hyper-V in Windows 11 Open the Run Box Type AppWiz.cpl and then click OK to open Windows Control Panel Features pane. Select Turn Windows Features On or Off or you can type optional features in the run box to launch turn windows features on or off a window. Choose the checkbox next to Hyper-V, Hyper-V Management Tools and Hyper-V Platform. Click OK. Wait then select Select Restart Now. Now you can start creating virtual machines to run other operating systems on. Step 3. How to enable Hyper-V using PowerShell in Windows 11. Click the search button, type PowerShell you need to run Windows PowerShell as administrator. After launching Windows PowerShell, enter the command below to enable Hyper-V. Enable Windows optional feature online feature name Microsoft Hyper-V All. Type Y and then hit Enter to restart the computer. Once completed, Hyper-V must be enabled and ready to use. Third step. How to create virtual machines in Windows 11 Hyper-V. Type Hyper-V Manager in the search bar after clicking on the search button as shown in the image below. Open it under the Action menu, select New and then Virtual Machine. New Virtual Machine Wizard, click Next. Specify Name, Location and then click Next. Select Generation 2 and then click Next. Assign Virtual Machine Memory and click Next. Configure Networking, select Default Switch, and click Next. Select Create New Virtual Machine Option, Saved Location, Disk Size, and click Next. Installation Options, Select an operating system from, and click on the Browse button to select Operating System ISO. Select Windows 11 ISO and click OK. Click Next. Review the new virtual machine summary and then click Next. Now a virtual machine was successfully created. This guide showed you how to enable and use Hyper-V in Windows 11. Thanks for watching my video like share and subscribe my channel.